Hi, welcome to my channel and today I'm going to take you along with me and show you how I check on to my analytics. We're at my computer right now, so uh, let's get it going. Don't forget to like, subscribe and share. On my channel page. And uh, as you see, I get pretty much all the information that I need. I can see uh, this, this video has been around for a week, okay, 90, 94 views and stuff. So you get different information here right away. You know immediately how many subscribers you have so far when you are on your channel page. And um, you can get more, more, more in-depth information. Uh, image of your page there on your profile you click you're going to youtube studio uh-huh just a second now uh if you get onto youtube uh on, on your youtube page um you will get pretty much all the information again as well i on your dashboard just make sure that it actually lands on your dashboard and i normally focus on a far uh, right side of the screen here because this is where I get you know the main information same as what we saw on the uh, channel page uh, 31 subscribers but I get more extra information that says in the last 28 days I gained 10 subscribers more so that means that my performance for this last month really only gave me extra 10 subscribers so guys <laughs> we're definitely going to have to uh, up our games here yeah so uh the next thing summary here that you get as well as for the last 28 days as a default normally land on 28 days uh with that what you get is uh the number of views you get in the last 28 days and also the watch time hours so i've got right now about 11 more hours than in the last 28 days which is perfect which is good now watch when I toggle on to that, when I uh, hover on to the number, you know you know what it says? It says, in the last previous uh, 28 days, my performance was only two hours, two and 2.8 hours. And when I uh, hover on to this number as well, it says before the last 28 days, that means the last segment of 28 days, I only gained 76, 76 views. And that, Compared to the 313 views, my game went up 312%. Now, this is really important here because you get to have your performances in 28 days by segment. So right now, like I just showed you there, uh, the 28 days you just saw here uh, is how I grew. And then by keeping the mouse over, you get to see the uh, previous segment, like the previous 28 days prior, before these 28 days you see in here okay like uh for example down below here you get to see as well the 28 days of watch hours and the prior 28 days before that as a, in segment so it's very important if you're only new on this channel so please don't forget to subscribe and same as the watch hour time uh basically as you toggle again like i said the last segment of 28 days previous to this I only got 2.8 hours and that means that my performance at the moment which is 11.1 .1 hours it's an improvement of up to 3 to 301 percent so i pretty much should be happy about my performance though 10 extra subscribers guys you need to help out a brother make me make me stand out please you know Okay, so here I don't focus, uh, I'm not going to focus much on this today here, but as you can see already, this normally as a default, it normally usually lands on to uh, your last, your, your last upload video. So anyway, so we go back onto the far right side of the, of, of the screen. I want again, here by default, you have 28 days. Okay, so uh, for me, I... You know, I don't want to go into the nitty gritty because all of the information you already know. You yeah, have 313 views, uh, 11 point one watch hours. You get 10 extra subscribers. It's pretty much the repetitive information, but it's kind of been uh, 
uh, submitted to you are in a different way. So I would like to go a bit into C more. All right. Okay. So before I go into C more, let's talk about the actual reason why I look into this. It's my retention. Okay. In my view, in my view, retention view is very important. Okay, so I go into here and check, you know, which one is performing better. So what is the average retention rate on a YouTube video? So the average retention rate is 35% to 40%, as you can see, as it's listed here. You know, to, at least you should do 50%, but it's, you know, 35 to 40% is the average low. Just to keep in mind, the audience retention is the amount of time people spend on each video. So, for example, if you want to help me grow, you can watch the whole video from the beginning to the end. If you watch only halfway, that way, it will show my uh, 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 viewer retention quite low. So, 35 to 40 percent is the low average retention. So, um, if you want to grow on YouTube, you will need at least that minimum. But if you want to do much, much better, I'm going to show you again as well on that one. It's the uh, higher, you know, average retention. So I'm going to show you as well uh, as you as we go through this. If you're only new on this channel, so please don't forget to subscribe. So we go back onto my channel. How how is my position here? Okay, 35 percent to 40 percent. Ah, I don't think I should worry too much. Some of these videos actually doing really, really well. You know, I had that 63%, which is fine. So I'm not, I'm a little bit above the average job, if I can say that. But then again, I'll take you back here just to let you know a little bit more. Now here, the, the, the requirement really is 60 to 70%. 6 to 70%, which will have, you know, which will actually help, uh, uh, you know, you, the algorithm to push your YouTube. Uh, your videos so uh so when we look at that 50 to 60 uh, 6 to 70 percent uh, i got only one video in it okay so uh, you know yeah so it, it, again it's not really there's a lot i can do to improve my videos but the most important thing here which we take away is that uh say if you're supporting my channel uh, it'd be nice if you watch uh, this whole the video up to the end <laughs> you know because that will help me improve uh, another thing i just look into here as well is uh i'm going to see more when i want to click here to see more yeah see more okay so see more again we have 20 in the last 28 days uh it gives at least my last my highest views you know uh recently in the last 24 28 days you know, it normally gives you five videos, so I get to see, um, you know, how how far each video goes. Because when you when you launch a video, look, when you upload a video, it hits the peak, you know, right away. Look at this one here, uh, the yellow one, which is uh, how to build confidence with a YouTube video. Immediately, I only uploaded it just two days after after uploading the uh, how to choose a name for your YouTube channel but then, you know so by looking at this trend here what I learned from it is it's probably best if you upload videos closer you know it might actually be able to keep you at a high peak so the fact that I'm taking too much days in between I'm actually hurting myself so I get to learn that so it's something I'm looking into improving uh, and then, so now I've got total, total here. Uh, that will be able to give me just one, one line instead of a bunch of them. It give me one line, no more, much multiple colors. So it just shows me uh, uh, basically the overall performance of all the videos. Let's say if it was in one thing. But so again, you can remember when I told you you have the orange color and the other video that I did because they were not separated too far you know here what it does is it's showing me as a one thing so basically I did not hit the ground from the 14th all the way 
you know, this is what it's showing me. You know, I almost touched the ground here on the 19th. Uh, almost, but I didn't because this video is not also too far. So I actually ended up hitting the ground here, down, anyway, yeah? Well, as you begin to get into it, you'll notice that one video a week isn't really enough. So what you need to do is, you know, upscale, okay? And it will change your numbers. And as you can see on this graph here, the closer you do, you, you, you make your, you, you post your videos, the more you, 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 you remain at a high peak. That means your viewership gets, you know, remain on a higher level. So it's really, really important. Like in my case right now, I do understand now that I need to change. I need to change. I need to stop doing a one video a week. I need to start making at least two videos a week and so on. And you will see that as we go on. And that's my goal for this month of February. I will try and do that for you guys. I will keep doing my videos and post my videos. One video a week is okay. When you're only a beginner, because it will help you learn. And uh, the more comfortable you get, the better you can actually and quicker you can do multiple videos in a week. In my stage right now, I believe that it's time for me to do more than one video in a week. And I can see, showing me, as you can now see on the screen here, I need more. So this is what I learned. Two videos in here. That one, it's a, it's a white peak. One video here in the center, somewhat far from other videos, it is, it's, a, it's a short peak. And then the next time around, could not even reach. So, so that's just one thing I wanted to also point out. One of these things I begin to learn as I go. But uh, so far, as you can see, I've been taking gaps in between. Anyways, I'm willing to change that. So February will be a different kind of month. And you will all see that uh, I will actually produce way more videos than before. All right, so uh, yeah, well, that's it. Um, we'll get out of it, okay? Um, so I'll go back onto my uh, channel. You can go back onto your channel this way as well. Let's go to your channel. Um, I'm back onto my channel, and uh, I can watch something. Click on the wall of my channel. Again, so point number one, predictable interaction. So when people come to your channel, they actually expect in some form of a, a type of a interaction. They know that they will get. There you okay, go. So, so I got out of it. So that's pretty much it. Um, yeah. Um, yeah, let's talk some more. Let's keep the conversation going, you know. You're only new on this channel, so please don't forget to subscribe. Stay awesome. Stay awesome. On to the next one.